Welcome to Zanzi Student Cribs, the show where we explore the student life, life in varsity in particular, everything that calls the word student. So what we do is we travel across the country every week in search for different student accommodations, different student life, Uguti life, Iba Trita Ranjani Abandona in varsity, the accommodation, the academics, the drama, everything that calls the word student. So when are 2K in high school trying to find out Uguti how's life in varsity, this is the show for when. Oh, when are students that's already in varsity, which how I course, find out about your surroundings. Stay tuned, Illuminati. Good morning, good people. It's your boy Safari Timba, and today I'm here with Mzanti Student Cribs. Today, what we're going to check out is a beautiful place here in Melville, and it's called The Campus. Come with me as we check it out. Yeah, knowing that in time, it will stop paying. There's no point of being faithless. Hey, no point of point of being faithless. Hey, focus on the blessing. The blessing. Yeah, follow the blessing. The blessing. Blessing. Oh, okay, okay, like. Hey, burn for tame with the big boy. What up, what up, what up? This is how we're gonna start off the video by first checking out the one bedroom apartments. So, let me show you what money like 7,300 rands can do for you. Come through with me. So, we start the scene off in the bedroom where you have like a double bed type situation for you and your person, you know, comfy and not. So, man can get comfortable, do whatever he like, whenever he like. And then, as you proceed inside, what we have over here is like a private TV. So man can get like Netflix, DSTV, you feel me? And then we proceed inside, um, what you notice is like a heater for winter, for the cold nights, for the nights when the hunt isn't pulling through. You got something to keep you warm. And then what we have over here is like a study room for man, because man's got to hit the books. Man really has to hit the books. So if you're trying to hit the books, you can hit them hard right over here. And then you can also like keep your stuff in these little compartments that are all over the place. And on my right, this is where you get to keep your books whatsoever. I like to keep my books in a place like this. You got extra space for whatever you're trying to do over there. And then enough space for all that drip. That drip, you get to keep it in here. All of that, you can keep your shoes maybe at the bottom whatsoever. And yeah, as you proceed, as you can see, also it's like a fully fitted kitchen where you've got your microwave, personal microwave, your own fridge, you got no roommates and all of that. And then as you get to the kitchen, you've got a granite top kitchen, like your mama's kitchen. You feel me? Yeah, and that's what's up. So you get to put all your stuff over here and now space for all your spoons, your dishes, all of that in, in, in and all about. And then over here, what I have is like a bathroom where like, you know, man's gotta hit the shower early in the morning, you know, and just trying to get their water in. This is where you do it, you get it done. You keep yourself outside just so you don't drop the soap. You don't drop the soap in here, you know, you've got like your also like your own personal, like your own personal space over here so you can do whatever you want to do in here, you know, without ever being bugged by anyone whatsoever. That's the case. Hit burn for tame with the big boy. Instagram showing you got big toys. Daddy saying you don't have it, just noise. When it comes to offering, why you putting cons? Do these things need to change? Friends with no value, they not stay. It's a big price that I'm willing to pay for a better day. That's for the fame. What up once again? So now where we add is like in what we call a shared studio, which gives like more or less the same type of vibes like the single bedroom, but what makes it special is about to come. So in here we got the kitchen, which has basically more or less the same amenities as like the one bedroom studio, but um, what you can see is like a more wider space. And the reason for that is what I have right behind me, which is like two beds facing each other, which provides like a more intimate space between two people who may be sharing this place. And what I like the most is like how these two face each other and like they kind of create a sense of environment where you can like be present in the moment with your roommates. So what we have is like public of space for roommates A and space for the other roommate B. Now, and as much as they might not have a balcony, but what we do find in this room and what they do have, however, is a view of Campus Square. My blessing, oh, I 
have patience, I'm patient. I get more busy as I started waiting, waiting. Put my faith in action. Knowing that I'll stop painting, stop, stop painting. There's no point of being painless. Hey, hey. No point of being painless. Hey, yeah. Focus on the blessings. Hey, I have patience, I have patience. Big up all. Now, in here is a kitchen slash sitting room. It has an open plan, which allows also for you to interact with your environment. Who architect? Ute. This place looks industrious. Rustic. Nagogong. Mara. We can all see and agree. It's got laundry rooms and enough machines for when and a squad. Uting keze, ikruen bange. Now improve study rooms which lock out the noise from outside. Why to top it off? The student accommodation provides laptops for you to use free of charge. Yeah, yeah. My blessing. Have the patience. No point of being faithless. faithless. This yeah. is I have patience, I'm patient. I got one more busy as I started waiting. Ayy, I'm putting my faith into action. Yeah, knowing that in time, it will stop painting. Another cool area that I'd like to show you guys is the game room. This is a very good area to come and release your stress and just be amongst people who are just trying to tone it down a bit and just work it out. Yeah. You feel me? <laughs> <laughs> I can't accept such, bro. Lost me, dog. Lost me. Liar. What I'm about to show you in here is a very, very special place which I very much love. An indoor cinema. So, um... If you're trying to blow up some steam, but the place for you to do that is this indoor facility that we do have here at the campus, which is a fully fitted gym with state-of-the-art equipment like any other professional gym would have. I'm from PTA. Yeah, I come PTA. from PTA. I was there all my life. I came uh, this side to study. To study in Johannesburg. Yeah, How did you find that transition between like Johannesburg and yeah? yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah. Joburg. Joburg is a crazy city in mm -hmm. itself, but like being away from home is the real transition. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So being on my own, having to get back on my own, <laughs> back, we had a bag. Oh, like, having yeah. to just like survive, you know, okay. having to move different. Yeah. That's been the biggest thing yeah. issue, yeah. yeah. And then what do you do in Johannesburg? Bro, I, I study at the Academy of Sound Engineering. Oh, it's I'm, a, I'm a musician, so oh, I make music. I'm studying that so that I can like really hone my craft, really get better at it, really get to where I deserve to be. Yeah. So tell me, um, how's the vibe here at the campus? How are you finding it? <laughs> okay, I moved, this is my first year at the campus, right? Yeah. I moved here beginning of this year. Um, and it's my it's my first time being out of the house with Reds, right? Okay, yeah. And this place, 
is crazy. <laughs> it was down. It was down. This yeah, place yeah. is crazy, yeah. bro. It's like, it's like there's an opportunity on every floor. Uh -huh. It's, it's time, random opportunities, yeah. and it's a, there's a lot of great places to to chill, like recreational what's places. Your, what's your favorite, like? My favorite, place? yeah. Bro. Okay, if I want to eat, yeah, then it's the second floor kitchen. Okay. I think it's second. If I want to chill or, you know, do a bit more than just eat, yeah, then yeah. it's fourth floor. Because that's, <laughs> that, yeah, that's, that's, that's the that party, place, bro. Yeah. I've never swam in that pool. Uh, I, will, I no. doubt I will touch that pool. Do people ever swim there? People do. Swim. Oh, okay. <laughs> Goes down in there. Women swim in that pool. Uh. <laughs> yeah, 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 but, yeah. But, but yeah, like, I, I really enjoy this place, dog. Like, I wouldn't have chosen a different race. Uh. And now, like, I'm in a two sharing room, yeah. but my roommate is in here, mm -hmm. so this is my room. In a so I'm not complaining, bro. <laughs> like, yeah. yeah, especially it's like the cheapest option, I think. So okay. getting a lot for, it's just a bunch of different things. But one thing I do love about this place is the facilities oh, yeah. that they have, like yeah. that we can have access to. Yeah, like yeah, just the fact yeah. that we can have a fully stocked gym or yeah. cinema that still runs or game rooms that we yeah. can like chill in when stressed out. Study rooms, like bro, and yeah. the study rooms have laptops. Yeah, that we can use um, if like you you don't have that yet or yeah. whatever. Yeah, so. And that is it for me, Safari Timber. See you on the very next episode of Zaid Student Cribs.